purpose of this video is to show people how to pick a 777 step group and then compare it to the quote unquote, I guess, Dark Geese step group, which is, you know, the one I've been using. Because quite frankly, I'm going to start using the 777 group. First thing first, let me show you the Dark Geese step group and, you know, the advantages and disadvantages of it. This step group, you pick blue first, you pick blue second, you pick advanced. You got Kim, it's a step group. This one you've seen me with in the video. But like I said, it's probably the last time you're gonna see with me in the video, so if I do is just some you know, like screwing around. The counter before in my opinion. You have step groove, as you see, you can do, you know. That's the DG step group. However, the issue I have with this groove is that I gain meter every time I freaking attack. So when you see me, you know, cancel to a super or whatever, it's because I didn't anticipate it filling up that fast. Uh, for the most part, sometimes I, you know, most, most of the times, like in the first video, I did that on intentional. But towards the end, I'm not doing intentional. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm dodging. I'm saying, oh, it's not gonna fill up that fast. But you know, it fills up too fast because I have advanced mode. So every time I attack, it's gonna give me meter, and I do not like that at all. I like having control of my meter from the get go. So that's a disadvantage I really have with this particular groove. So I told myself today I was gonna figure out how to pick the 777 groove. And I figured it out. Now the irony of it is that 777's groove, the step, is a flip of the groove that I use the most. It's just a total flip of it. And the groove I use the most is red first, blue second, and then extra. Well, 777 step groove is just a flip of that. It's blue first, red second, then extra. That's all it is, guys. That's how you get his groove. And you know, like I said, this is what I'm going to be using from here on out when I want Kim on my team, man. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm getting proficient with Kim, as y'all as y'all see. You know, quite proficient. So I mean, he's he's actually going to be a, a backup on one of my on my tournament teams. You know, just because you know I'm getting pretty comfortable with him. So let's compare and contrast 777 step group to the dark geese step group. That will no longer be the dark geese step group. Once again, you see how I'm walking. I'm a step. It's step. I'm still hopping. Same thing. I'm stepping. See, I gained no meter. I gained no freaking meter. And that's how 777 is able to do that stuff. He's able to do with accuracy like that and not get any meter. Because I sat there and I was like, man, he's got blue and he's got red on his ultimate meter bar. And he's not getting any meter. How's he doing it? So I told myself that I to figure it out. I have. So now, you know, enables me to charge whenever I want to. Or, you know, of course, if someone hits me. So that's what I want. Just like my other group. And it's just, like I say, it's just the flip of the group I use the most. So I'm going to be using it pretty often. Especially with EA Jerry. Because then, you know, I can... Charge on me right when I want to, and you know, if you jump, you're gonna eat a hollow shell cooking for a perfectly timed shin shell roofing. I mean, it has to be perfectly timed if you want to use it as an anti air because it doesn't admit, have quite the admit putting start. But, uh, I mean, you know, of course, with this groove, you can do stuff like You do stuff like I mean like that. I mean you see it doesn't get any meter, it doesn't get any meter at all. It doesn't get any meter. So I mean if you're wondering, you know, why does 777 do this, this group right here. He'll do the, he won't do the stomp anymore. He doesn't do the stomp anymore. I think it's actually kind of smart. Because uh, once you do the stomp, it takes away your wake-up options. Take a look. See? I and mean, he wakes up before you do. So you can't jump across over and try to set it up again. So 777 will do it, you know, he won't, he won't do wake up when he, when he does it. Or he, he, won't, he won't do stop so he has wake up options.
See, when you do stuff like that, if you don't do the stomping thing, and that's genius on my part. It really is nice. So, I hope y'all, you know, enjoyed this tutorial right now. I'm going to get back to my, you know, training with Ken. Um, <laughs> you know, as you notice, I don't have any memory, I mean, the extra characters on my, right now, my select screen, because, uh, my memory card's at Roberto's house, and I've been able to catch up with him. So, uh, you know, I'll try to catch up with him over this weekend, or, you know, we'll game some more, whatever. We'll play, so, and, you know, see how things come out. So that's about it, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed this little tutorial. I'll, I'll get back to y'all soon. Peace.